In this short video, I want to show you how uh, Naked and Famous jeans fade in. Here I have three different variations, three different jeans with three different denim and three different feet actually too from the brand. Uh, I love the brand, it's a Canadian brand and they do quite great job with their jeans. In my opinion, I think they are still pretty affordable, most of their jeans pretty affordable, they do some crazy stuff with their jeans, absolutely different materials, absolutely different um, colors, they just crazy um, in a good sense of it. Um, and uh, here I want to show you some of uh, my jeans from them and how they are aging. Uh, so uh, this is their expensive model uh, made in Japan, this is uh, Emperor of Slab, it's 23 ounce and uh, it start to fade as you can see i will want to show you in different light a little bit how they are aging i don't wear them that often because they are pretty heavy so i mostly wear them during cold days in the winter time winter time uh, but i like them the fit is great despite the fact that they have really heavy jeans they are soft and uh, it's pleasure to wear them actually. Uh, I like to wear them during uh, colder days. Um, this is their most popular feed, Weird Guy. So it's like regular feed with uh, average rise and slightly tapered. Uh, the feed is great actually, and uh, this feed is most popular from them. Uh, another jeans here in another denim, it's um, Elephant 8. They they introduced a couple of years ago. Um, this is Supima Cotton, which makes this uh, jeans, this denim very soft. And uh, I like to wear them. This is an easy guy uh, fit, which is very roomy, uh, very tapered and uh, with the high rise um, fit. So um, th this denim is 21 ounces. So it is pretty heavy and I also wear them mostly during colder days um, in the winter time. And um, as you can see, it's aging pretty well. I like how it fades. Uh, the fade is nice. Uh, I like how it's going so far. And uh, I wish I could wear them more uh, because I love how soft they are. It is a uh, very comfortable uh, fit to wear and um, very great denim to have. I uh, uh, love them very much, actually. And um, another of my jeans from them is my very old uh, friend that actually, I think it was one of the first uh, raw denim that I bought, one of the first salvage and raw denim that I bought, and that was from Naked and Famous. And um, this fit, I believe they call it slim. Let me see or skinny, uh, if I still have something here. Okay, it's a dirty fade model. Skinny, okay, yeah, yeah, it's here. It is skinny guy. I think they discontinued this feed. Not sure about that, actually. I haven't checked if they still have this feed, but that's how these jeans aged over the years. I have them for about uh, seven years, I would say, or something like that, maybe even eight. Mm, yeah, I think more close to eight. The, everything is great. Everything's still here. Uh, it's start destroying on the crotch here, start destroying here in this area. But it's still wearable. I still wear them during summer days and I still love them. The fit is not as great for me because I love more roomy fit right now, but still it is great jeans and that's what it does over the years i uh they had they, they've been in my rotation for some time it's not like i was wearing just these jeans i was wearing them along with some other and still it got great fade um in my opinion so that's what it is that's how it looks and uh, i think naked naked and famous they do a very decent and great job with their jeans. They are pretty available uh, to buy online and um, they are pretty affordable, I would say. Most of their jeans pretty affordable. I'm not talking about some um, jeans like, for example, uh, 
uh, King of Slab or Emperor of Slab, they are more expensive because they made in uh, Japan and uh, they mm, kind of more uh, premium product from the brand. But still, it is great brand to know. It is great uh, jeans to have, to wear. And the variety of their denim, variety of their uh, fits and jeans is outstanding. So if you haven't checked this brand yet, uh, I suggest you check it out and see what they have. I think they produce very well priced product. And uh, along with jeans, they do some other stuff, but I never bought anything from them aside of jeans. So I can speak only for jeans right now. And um, yeah, that's, uh, that's what it is. So that's how so that's how naked and famous jeans are aging thank you guys for watching if you like the video hit the notification bell and don't forget to subscribe take care and i will see you next time